Hey there, everyone, this is Al Calvin, Sonic 4. Some people might notice slight differences in the video. Very subtle, though. <laughs> so let's just get right in first. Uh, casino Street, not night. It's the streets of the casino. Neon City, uh, Drift the Night. Yeah, we'll play this out. Hi, hey, hey there, everyone, this is Al Cal. Yeah, so turns out the game has full screen support and widescreen. However, Sonic remains smack dab in the middle of the screen, ensuring that I still don't have the vision I would want, but I guess that's the world we live in today. Want to bounce a little neon hamburger. Not an option right now. All right, so yeah. So yeah, turns out this has like all these option things. So here's the thing. I started playing PC games, like, r relatively recently, right? And, uh, whoa, -ho -ho. I guess we're running. Or I guess we're bouncing. I guess we're pinballing. Like, like, I don't know. Like, when did I really start playing a lot of PC games? Like, in the last five years, maybe? So, I'm just kind of used to, com like, you know, computer games, they kind of know how to set up their options for me. Like, I can more or less just kind of believe them and let them do their thing, and uh, I'll have a good time. I am not used to, you know, 2010. Uh, back when PC ports were typically not great. And so, you know, I, I, I just didn't think that uh, there would be options I could change, and it doesn't help that, okay. Like, I showed the, uh, the, uh, well, well, I guess I'm flying over here now. Who are we going to casino today? Maybe depends how I'm flying. I wanted to land on the thing. Yeah! Oh, it's automatic. It's not automatic. I don't know if it's automatic. Give me the three Sonic. I'm pressed up. Okay, yeah, there we go. Yeah! And so many points. Too many points. So anyway, I just kind of didn't think that there would be uh, options that I wanted to change that would be relevant to me. And it doesn't help that if we, I showed this option screen yesterday, there's like nothing. It's like sound things, right? Ooh, I like the little like emerald theme at the base of this. So turns out, if you open the game not from the desktop icon, but from Steam itself, <laughs> Not only are you allowed to open up the game, but also it will ask you if you want to open a separate program for settings that requires you to have Java installed, by the way. <laughs> Which, oh, that's funny. Uh, I guess you're sitting over here, huh? All right, we can do that. That. So after installing Java, which, what? Uh, <laughs> 2010, that's what, drum. Hooray! Uh, I got access to this whole separate thing to let me adjust resolution and put a game full screen. Which, wow, hilarious. Okay, so, uh, yeah, this will be played a little bit different. Yeah, this is clearly a straight forward edge. We're gonna go in the Capricorn Zone. So here we are. Hey there, everyone. This is how I'm playing this game. <laughs> First entire act was me sort of trying to struggle my way <laughs> through that non-story. No regrets. It had to be said. And man, so I I heard so I heard the story being told. Oh, the frame rate here looks kind of bad. Uh, the the um, okay. What what what? We'll go down here. Yeah, open up. So apparently, according to the lore I was given. This game was never meant to be Sonic 4 in the first place? That is wild! So, to relate what I was told, and I remember, basically, Dems were working on their own thing. They were like, you know what, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna make like our own little like mobile Sonic. It's gonna be a good time, probably, I don't know. We're just kind of putting this together for fun. And then, you know what, sounds great. And then, and then, <laughs> And then Sega's like, hey, it's pretty rad what you got going there. How about we make that Sonic the Hedgehog 4? By the way, we're not giving you any additional resources, either temporal 
or material, just keep doing what you're doing and it's gonna be- Oh, th that was not an open up the door sound effect like I thought. It was a- uh, you got a something. I might not get the emerald because of that. Okay, it's that sound when you open it up. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Now I am somewhere in a tunnel of hate. I will have to replay you one day. Yeah, oh shoot, well there's time there. Can I get it though? And it's 10. You know, I, I might have wasted more than 10 seconds trying to get that extra 10 seconds. It's pretty good. I have a, um... I'm not gonna press a button to play the next act, because I want to see something. I want to try something. Like, just like, yeah, saving. Because, uh, if we go here, can I play that? I cannot. So, oh, oh, alright. I'm not sure how I ended up there, but I ended up there. So... I guess before I can replay it, I have to actually clear it. That's unfortunate. Wrote a cards. Here we go. It's card zones. Also worth of note, uh, the mobile version of this game, completely different subject. Spin those die! Uh, has, is like a port. They're the same game, except for like some differences. Cards. Oh, do you get like prizes? Yeah, okay. Depending how it spins around, pretty great. Flip all of those cards. Look at all those Sonic heads. Uh, they're everywhere. I love my own face. Do Robotniks do anything? I think they're just nothings, right? It's pretty good. Always want to see and not. And you see, like the results down there. It's pretty good. All right, card. Yeah, it's card land. You're right about that. All these cards. Uh, destroy the world. Or the very least, these little dogs now run across the land! So yeah, yeah, this was never meant to be Sonic 4. That was... Sega being in- oh, well, that didn't work. <laughs> uh. Okay! You gotta hit it just right, and you just swing around the Moseys. Uh, destroy the world, if you want to. I do want. Here we go, then! Destroy the world with me! Hi! Alright, these are flipping around, it's pretty great. Go where the coins are at. If you don't, you might die. But that was not the case. It's a big mite, you know? A mighty mite found in between the pillows. I- Look, see, this is ridiculous, though, because, like, so... Okay, the game is in widescreen now, that's pretty rad. I somehow still don't feel... Like, I can see, like, at all in, in front of me. Whoa. Like, I'm not sure how you messed that up so bad. Well, the reason why is because even if you're in widescreen, Sonic still needs to be, by corporate degree, I guess, uh, be- Oh, shoot. Well, there's all the massive amount of rings I had. That's really sad. Because, you know, I like those rings. Uh, I was gonna invest them into a portal at the end of the level that might lead me somewhere fun or unfun. I don't know. The life jingle just keeps on bopping. And there's bats behind me. It's pretty great. Fans of bats will love bats. Probably. It stands to reason. Man, these guys are just... There you go. Uh, yeah. I feel like I was saying something and then I... Well, well, this ain't happening. That ish. Can you get like something if you get like matching pears or whatever? Matching apple trees? That would be pretty good. Please match your apple trees with me. What does that mean? I don't know. But the little meaner out of bombs. No, yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. Uh, get out of here, pile gem. So. The, like, specifically mobile versions of this game, some acts are actually different because they incorporate phone things, from what I understand. Uh, I, if this was ATS, I would feel obligated to play that. Since I'm not, I might not. Uh, I don't know, it just seems like such a hassle. Oh, shoot. Uh, Alright, platform sometimes will just leave you astray. Thank you, homing attack, for being reliable sometimes. 
Gonna take the underneath path cause it's kinda funny Except it's not, there's nothing funny about any of this Then the guy just kinda pushes me away That's the kinda thing that happens on the Sunday or Saturday, but that's okay with me I feel like, yeah, this is a kind of a long one. Oh boy, uh, well, uh, am I dead? I didn't solve the puzzle of the Flippy Bridge, I guess. That's unfortunate. Like, they, uh, and you can't jump up through them. Guess my timing was bad. Like, but like, how? <laughs> Sonic the something in the Ferris wheel in the background. Alright, well, I'm glad a game gave me a thousand lives here because this is where I'm gonna start losing them. So you get here, and then it's like, so just run? Okay, so that, my crime was, I wasn't running from the get-go. You have to just keep going, you have to not, like, just immediately, and then you're fine. Which, you know what? Fair, it's Sonic, but, I feel like the game, as of now, has been training me to kinda be careful. I thought I pressed, I did not press Y. I pressed X on the Xbox controller. Casino Climax! Climax of every casino is this. You know, you're kind of in the hotel, on the red carpet, and a weird digitized blue guy comes along and jumps into a cannon and gets blown up. <laughs> I don't know either. Like, like, is there a matter of them, like, having to aim them? I didn't try really hard to change the cannon. Cause there- Okay, yeah, you do change it manually. Alright, well there you go. Is this the first game where your homing attack has a homing reticle? Like, it's the first one in 2D, but I forget if Unleash had one of all things. Like, I just genuinely forgot. Because, I will say, like, for, for everything people have to say about everything, I appreciate having the homing reticle. Like, it doesn't make a lot of sense. I feel like the aesthetics of it are off because it makes it look like Sonic is like some kind of Terminator robot or something. But I appreciate it in terms of function. Oh, these are solid. Right, okay. Yeah, we're in, welcome to Spring Yard Zone, I guess. Idiot. Right, and then we can go up here, then we fly up somewhere, pop a robot spring on a spring, then we run real fast somewhere, everything. Guess I didn't aim immediately correctly with the arrow Just give it a slight tweak Then up somewhere up in the sky Follow the arrow, you don't know why You just do it cause they're there And it feels like a good idea Ultimate trap that robot and it could put Would be like uh, a thing where like it just put fake arrows or something Alright, this is not working out So what if I jump here? Like, I feel like that's what is expected of me. Oh, or that. All right. We did it. We saw, whoa. The flashing light of the wall texture there. Like, it's kind of freaking me out for a hot second. It's pretty good. Check it out. I'm on in the cannon now. I'm gonna blast up to some points and figure something out. Yeah. Hell yeah. Figuring something out. That's great. Explode over here, I guess. Turns out where you wanted to go was over here. Maybe destroy the world the one inch at a time, then try to blow through this wall. That ain't gonna happen. Don't know where I am. I went through a thing that's just kind of, sort of. Get a cannon, Sonic. Come on, you can do it. I believe in your ability to fly sideways, but not too sideways. Slightly less sideways. It matters. Uh, schnut. Okay, well, let's try this. So you can't homing attack a cannon, and just kind of like get into it immediately. Except there, I did like a little bounce thing. It's pretty good, I guess. So I don't have the rings now to guide me. Uh, don't remove the rings if they have to be used as guide, and it's credible that you might like fall. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Probably just me, what do I know? Homing, attacking, that didn't do what I thought it would. Alright, so we're just gonna fly up and miss, and we're gonna try again, I guess. 
go, here we go, here we go, then, yeah, there we go. We did it, we made it happen. Now I've got, you gave me a shield, then you gave me zero enemies. I don't know if you're aware of that. So giving me another shield just feels weird. All right, well, big, big noisy sounds, that's great. Blast through the ozone layer. Whoa, there's one up there. And we're back here, hey. Look at that. Uh, uh, there we go, follow all the trail. So now if I fall, I am stuck. <laughs> like, because they're gone. These are gonna fall, of course they will. There we go, between the springs. Uh, and down this pathway, lit with lights and balloon. I'm gonna do a bonus again. Like, I'm assuming it's gonna be the same bonus I attempted earlier. Like, that's just kinda, I feel, goes without saying. That it is extremely likely. So we're gonna be doing that. Look at that little pixelized little sticker. It's a little Sonic guy. Whoa, loading screen of Sonic. Right, so, this should be the same. I'm assuming it's gonna be the same. I don't know. But you know, I didn't get the prize, right? Like, yeah, 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 no, I see, it is. All right, so. So that ring gate, like I'm not sure if it's rings from a particular area that I need to make it happy, or if it's any ring at all. I don't know the answer, whoa. There, things got like really ugly and framey there. It's pretty wonderful experience. Right, yeah, so a little plot. And I know now that I need to get in there, so we just kind of have to dig our way through the candy. Ah, oh, there we go. No, please, please get in there. We need to get in there. Yeah, I need 12 more, so another two blocks of six. I can just leave that there because, like, I can just finish with that one. No, 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 no. I, uh, I can't tell if I'm doing better than last time. I'm gonna be real. Oh, oh, no, 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 This is not working! Yeah, now you're being stressful again. Just... Yes! Okay, that's good. I tried to get... No, please. Please? Okay. Oh boy, uh, like I'm not done. Oh shoot, it's just like right there. Yay, I am done! Okay, that was scary. I did not like that. <laughs> that felt so bad. <laughs> and then I press the button there to go straight to the boss. Saving, just not switch off power. Hey, it's Dr. Eggman's party! Finally, I can't believe we got invited. Sonic looks so stubby. No, okay, it's not. It's just a weird motion blur to give him. So this is straight up the boss from Sonic 2. Like, it's the same, like, claw machine. So, oh, okay. So I shook off, and then I was able to hit him through the claw? That seems to kind of belittle, like, the whole thing is going. So it's a less effective form of the boss from Sonic 2. Gotta! Like, what? Oh, see, there we go. Now he's starting the Sonic 2 part. Where you kind of have to go above him and do that. And then he blew up. What a non encounter. Robotnik, are you even trying? Also, you're tiny. When you got shrunken to a tiny form, did that shrink your brain? Like, is that what happened? Well, meanwhile, here's the real boss. It's getting him there. What? <laughs> like, how. Okay, um. If I do that, there we go, I solved the puzzle! And then Sonic moves on his own off of the capsule. I don't know why he did that, but Sonic defeated the boss! <laughs> it's not even Robotnik! <laughs> he defeated the, the boss, okay. Turns out this was Metal Gear all this time. Whoops! Surprise! Uh, hope you're not too shocked. <laughs> And next time, we're gonna be doing the Lost Labyrinth. Because again, like, yeah, like, this is done. You wouldn't know it looking at this, but it is done. And if we go here... Yeah, there's a score, so I'm allowed to replay it. That is a system that was devised for this game. Believe you me. 